this will be an incredible opportunity to show that we, you know, we have and grow the sport of rugby, hopefully in Canada, make them aware we have women's as well. Canada's first ever women's mixed ability rugby team is getting set to participate in the iMart World Cup in 2025 in Pamplona, Spain. The women's competition in Spain, there's going to be eight teams from all over the world, so we'll be kind of representing Canada when we go. Put together by the Oshawa Vikings Rugby Club, who will also be sending their men's mixed ability rugby team to the World Cup tournament. Um, and our roster is going to be made up of about 26 players of all abilities and ages, uh, ranging from ages to players playing their first uh, contact rugby games in their 50s, all the way to players that uh, are graduated from our junior programs. I think for all the girls in our club to see us women making the, making the trip to Spain, I think it's incredibly important and really special for all of us. But while they're breaking down barriers, they also have to be raising funds. Traveling to this international event is expensive. For this event, um, it's over $200,000 to take the players, coaches and support staff to, to the event in Spain. Players will be covering some of the costs, but we're hoping through fundraising and sponsorship um, kind of in the community um, that we're able to subsidize a good portion of, of, of that cost. All people, all women and people with disabilities can do anything they want. I think really, really, I'm really proud because I always watch Team Canada do anything. The tournament happens at the end of June next year. This team is hoping for some help fundraising to make sure the women get to play. If you can help, you can go to the Oshawa Vikings Rugby Club's website. In Oshawa, Audra Brown, City News.